Today I'm making this adorable rainbow baby quilt inspired by this sample we have in our shop at Quilty Pleasures. The pattern is called Rainy Day Junior and it's free from pen and paper patterns. To make the cloud, I used six different fat quarters which I cut into squares, arranged, and sewed the rows together. Then I attached the background fabric by snowballing the corners. Since I'm using flannel for my background, sometimes it stretches, but in the end it looks great. I also had to get creative with the piecing when I started running out of the background. And here's the completed cloud with the rows sewn together and all the background on. Then to piece the rainbow, I cut out strips of my rainbow fabric and my background and I put them together. This quilt turned out so cute. What do you think? And in the end, it was so fast and easy, I made two! Thanks for watching! Hi everyone! Recently I made an adorable rainbow baby quilt top. Now it's back from the quilter and I'm going to use the leftover rainbow strips to make a really cute binding. I had long and short leftover rainbow strips so I pieced them all together. I don't know about you but I always have to double check the orientation when I'm sewing the binding strips. It's looking so cute and colorful already! Next I used a quarter inch seam to attach the binding to the front of my quilt. Then flip that bad boy over. And I finished the binding off on my machine by doing a stitch in the ditch on the front of the quilt. Here is the final product! I really love how this rainbow baby quilt turned out. It's got the rainbow motif on the front and a really cute rainbow binding. The binding was a great way to pull the rainbow look together and a great way to use up my leftover rainbow strip. Thanks for watching! Good morning! Today I'm finishing off the binding for my second rainbow baby quilt. Just like with my other quilt, I'm using leftover strips to piece together a rainbow quilt binding. These strips are more pastel rainbow compared to the last quilt, which had more of a bold rainbow. Here I'm chain piecing all the binding strips together. I personally love chain piecing because it saves so much time. I attach the binding to the back of the quilt. That way when I flip the binding over, I can stitch it down to the front using a decorative stitch like this little wave. Here's the final product. The main quilt top, love the colorful rainbow, and the decorative stitch on the binding. The rainbow binding was a really cute accent to the quilt top. Thanks for watching!